channel and as you can tell by the title down there yes i brought you all along with me as i mentioned in my last or my latest upload with um my length check so i hope you did watch that but yes today i decided to bring you all um as i trim my hair and as you can see i kind of have them in um just some two strand twists so that i know i'm evenly trimming my ends um so yeah thanks for clicking on this video um, thanks for tuning in to yet another video and as you can see I'm you know I'm coming back to back with the uploads I definitely want to keep everyone entertained and show my consistency with my channel so with that being said um again well right now I have these on because I did wash my face and do all that stuff so I have to take those off now um but again I just um pretty much detangled earlier today with some leave-in conditioner and a little bit of moisturizer, Pantene moisturizer. Um, and I'm just going to go through and kind of gently or lightly just trim the end. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and show you all what I will be trimming my hair with today. <clears throat> and I'm using like a really bad area. I mean, it's great light as you can see, you know for me. Anyways, with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into what I am trimming my hair with. Um, now, I did actually want to show you all what I did use to moisturize my hair. My last video, I just went in with a leave-in conditioner by African Pride and then a Pantene moisturizer. Okay, nothing too heavy because it was really dry. That was another thing. Um, so, yeah, and then I'm going to use one of my rat tail combs. Um, you want to make sure you have a pair of barber shears, okay? Really sharp, 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 sharp scissors. Um, don't go using some school scissors like I tried. Like so, I'm going to probably use this brush. I really don't like this brush. And um, a wide tooth comb just to detangle and make sure I'm getting everything. Now, I'm not going to trim all of my hair on camera for you all, but I just want to show you all just in case you wanted to trim your hair one day. Now, um, disclaimer, I'm not a professional. You do not have to take my advice. I am just showing you all how I do it. So I decided to come out with a how-to video on how Brie Denise decides to trim her natural hair. Okay? So with that being said, yeah, we're definitely going to go ahead and jump right into it. And this flash off is really blinding me. So um, if I'm not looking directly at you, it's not you. It's really just this flash. It's really bright. Um, so yeah, we are going to go ahead and get into, I guess, the first one here. And I'm not... Okay. Why too cool? See, really doesn't need it. This brush. And you see, my hair is really detangled, but you can feel what well, y'all can detangled. I hope y'all can see. Jesus, this flash is really like blinding. Okay. And I have a clip over here, which I am going to use so I do not trim any hair that does not need to be trimmed. We would hate that, right? So we have our first, I'm just going to trim just a little bit more, just to make sure I get like a, okay, straight line kind of, there we go, and you can see it's literally just a perfect glide. Okay. I think I just grabbed like a piece of hair on the side, but it's cool. I think that was like a clean, smooth trim. Okay. So that is what I'm going to do. And then as I, you know, trim, now that was just a small section just to show you all how I'm going about this. But I am going to do like a little bit, bits and pieces like literally bigger sections, more bigger than that, okay? And then I'm just going to twist it right back up so I know what I have and have not cut it. And then I'll be able to tell because it should be a breeze twisting these and my end should definitely look a lot different with two strand twists now. As such, maybe that wasn't such a good idea. And it was also the lighting. Perfect lighting as well. This one's making me 
go up a little high here. Alright, that's it. I'm not going up any higher. Yeah, it's a bit more of a smoother color. Way better. gradually grow here. Just like our hair. A little bit better, I guess. And I'm gonna double up on these. Alright. And that's literally how I trim my hair or how I'm going to trim my hair today. Um, <laughs> nothing extravagant. And then clips as well and kind of clip it in just like that and that's how I'm going to move about so I'm going to take a quick break here and then I'll be back when I finish I would say half of my hair so I'll see y'all in a few seconds okay y'all so I wanted to go ahead and show y'all this last section on camera um, and what I've done is you know each section that I trim I was getting a little confused um, with twisting them back up and plus I ran out of clips to clip the end, so I just decided to take bobby pins and kind of put them in band two looking knots, as you can see. And then all I have is just this side to trim, which I will finish off camera by the time I do this. Like, yeah, I'll be probably editing this video. <laughs> um, so I just wanted to show y'all this one last section here. And as you can see how it's like just so hard to pull through. My ends are just really horrible where they were on this side. And you can tell on that one right there, that's like a clean cut. Anyways, so I just want to make sure it's fully detangled. Side of my hair is completely trimmed. Okay, um, so I'm going to finish this side over here, which still needs to be trimmed, and then I'll definitely come back and I'll probably like have it all taken out and I'll just comb through to show you all the results and the big difference. So I'll see you all back in a minute. See you back. Alrighty, everyone. So I have officially finished trimming all of my hair. I have trimmed it all, and I have literally just pinned them up and sections with little bobby pins um, but I'm completely done and I really just thought about it. I was like even if I show them like brushing through it it really doesn't do any justice so I thought hmm let me go ahead and show them the amount of hair that I did trim off 
So with that being said, in the next scene, you all will just see like a little pile of, you know, the trimmings, um, all the dead hair that I did get off. So with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into that scene. Okay, y'all, so this is <laughs> my trimmings, okay? Alrighty, everyone, so that is that. Um, I just want to say thank you all for tuning in to yet another video. Thanks for coming along as I trim my hair after one year of doing the big chop um, so I continue to keep up with you know this maintenance just to continue um, hair growth and to see how long my hair gets so with that being said thank you all for tuning in if you are new here thanks so much for clicking on this video make sure you tap that subscribe button make sure you hit that like button make sure you tell a friend tell another friend tell another friend come join the family well, with that being said y'all um, I'm gonna go find out what to eat for dinner tonight and I'll see you all on my next upload Mwah.